Hello everyone. Uh, yesterday Microsoft was installing updates. So we talked about the October update and now it's here. Um, so I'm going to go ahead and just take a look at three things uh, that got updated. I'm sure there was a lot more things, but three things that were pretty interesting. For example, here in uh, Intelligent Cloud, Intelligent Cloud Insights. If I click on that, this wasn't there um, before last week. After yesterday, it came in. Now we can see KPIs and then CAS available, sales profitability, net income, uh, things like 10 of your customers are late with their payments to you, etc., etc. We got some Power BI reports. Uh, could be interesting, could not be. But at least it's something that Microsoft is pushing a lot where the system is thinking for you. Uh, it's trying to figure out what you should be looking at um, given all the data that's in there. So nice addition. Another thing is if I go into items, and this actually works with items, it works with vendors, it works with customers, all of the entities. Here I have a list of items. And on the right hand side, we have our fact boxes. Yes, just like we had in 2018, they're back. Very nice. I don't know if you remember, but before this, we only had the item attributes and the forecast. Now we have item details, uh, you know, with planning, very, exactly the same as 18, basically, all in here. So beautiful addition. Now, another thing that is super important, and I'm going to change this into a list so that we can see our inventory availability. You see the quantity on hand is right here, right? Yes, we had that before. I got like 250 of the paper coffee cup, etc. Now, if I go here into all, show filter pane, I can filter my totals. And I can filter that by, for example, a location. And so for those who don't know what this is, and I'm just going to click here on the main location, it filters the sum fields on the list. So in this case, it's quantity on hand. Quantity on hand is summing up all the transactions that are in each location. And now I'm filtering on the main location, so I see just the quantity on hand for the main location. For those who know NAV and know about this stuff, this, these are flow filters. We got flow filters back, which is awesome. So these were three things uh, that were added yesterday. There's a bunch more, but this is kind of the obvious stuff. Oh, I'm going to add the fourth one. Just remember it. Up here, there used to be a magnifying glass. Now there is a light bulb. If I click on the light bulb, it asks me, tell me what you want to do. And let's say if I start writing here, um, if I can get the keyboard up like so, Intercompany. It starts looking for pages, tasks, reports, and stuff like that. So before we had this list of like basically addresses. Uh, now we have a segmented list categorizing what you need. And I can click here on show all. And now I see all of the things that are pertinent. So that's the fourth one. Yeah, but the fourth one is probably one of the best, right? But they're all good. Yeah, they're all great. Amazing. We just went through this yesterday. Um, yesterday morning, I went to my old business central. This morning, new business central. What did I do? Zero, nothing, just logged in. So this is the future. Enjoy it.